Chloe's uh, customer has kindly let me show you how she's organized her large close to my heart organizer and it looks really great sorry the kids are having great fun with a balloon rocket experiment in the other room um, so she's got a lot of stuff that isn't close to my heart so just bear with me she's managed to accommodate her dies if you have to see here so she's got her close to my heart mini stamps her regular stamps at the back she's got her cuddlebug alphabet then she's got her various stencils then a um, quick cut die then she's got all her um, like a, a, this embossing folder then her kazaz embossing folders kazaz dies and so on and well just here after the close to my heart stamps are the close to my heart embossing folders over here she's got her stamping up stamps and then all her kazaz stamps that she's still got to sort out and package up and then back here she's put her rubber stamps onto laminated pieces of card into Ziploc bags. Um, I understand she wants to get the envelopes that you can buy from Close to My Heart because they fit better. And she's taken scrap paper and she's stamped the images on both sides of the scrap paper so that she knows what's in there and written the code. So if anything happens to it, she can replace it. But just look at how much stuff you can fit in here. And there is still some wiggle room to fit more in. So while normally we talk about how many of the Close to My Heart stamp sets can fit into this container, I thought it would be nice to show you just how much, like look if I move that over like that, how much you can fit in when you have a mix of products in here. And it's really great that by taking out this divider, you can fit, if you look at these dot, these dies here, we've got, where's, where's a good example? So you've got a full set of nesting dies there. And there's, a, there's another nesting die. Another, oh, that's the one I just showed you. Um, you know, she's got a, a bow die and that sort of thing and just these ones and you know there's she's just got so much in here it's fantastic all right, all right. so heaps and heaps and heaps like she's got so many stencils and yeah so i hope that's of use and gives you an idea of how much stuff you can fit into one of these fantastic containers and you'll have to excuse me, excuse me wobbling because um, I don't have a tripod <laughs> so but everything usually it takes two hands but <laughs> everything fits in oops, perfectly into this large container and these containers will fit into one of the big, sorry, going to have to use the other hand. One of the big Aldi bags, which is great. There we go, all done up. Okay, thank you for watching.